Hello! Uh, hi there, it's me, it's Dave, or the Jaded Rabbit. God bless you, my friends. Thank you kindly for joining along for... Oh, God, more of this. <laughs> oh, I just really don't enjoy this game. But I play it. I play it. You know what? Combat League isn't as bad as uh, Weekly Quest. I've discovered that the weekly quest is way more tedious than Combat League. That's a thing. Huh, okay. Um, why you facts? Hello, CJ. <laughs> Thank you. I'm glad you enjoy the intro. So let's see where we're at. I think I'm at twenty. Yeah, twenty-two eighty-eight. So, uh, 212 points away from getting Grandmaster. Will there be a lag switch? <laughs> Only time will tell. But, uh, th th look, it's Manya. Look, there she is at Grandmaster. Grandmaster Manya. <sighs> <laughs> well, I need to get the skin. <laughs> So, yeah, so we're going to be doing Combat League. Have you finished everything in Combat League? This is the last weekend? Yes, uh, game will be gone, or season will be gone, rather. In less than three days? Ugh. Ugh, Combat League. <laughs> yeah. Okay, hopefully we get someone in a tier above us. That would be good. Also, yeah, you know, it might be prudent to take an L. Oh my god, it's a Grandmaster. <laughs> oh my god, it's a Grandmaster. Yay! Okay, so that looks like a Sindel orb of sorts. You know, combat cards don't mean anything. They're so ugly and tiny. Hey! It's a Liu Kang. <laughs> oh my god, he's got Kano as well. <laughs> what is this? <laughs> I don't have my my button. It's other controller setting. Ah. Ah. Kano. <laughs> <laughs> I think we're losing this round. Okay, you know what? While we do that... Uh, controller, controller, please go back to normal. <laughs> no, go back to the game! <laughs> Damn it! Ah, the throw! <laughs> oh no, <laughs> I did not realize. That's got some range. I never use that. Oh, now I'm using the wrong button. Ah! Okay, all right. Now we got Kano back to the proper button. This should go better. <laughs> but yay. Uh, oh my word. Matches. 
Okay, got a block. I now I see like that forward three four. It's pretty good. Oh no, throw, oh no. Ah, we're getting thrown, uh, no. Ah, one mistake, we got him. <laughs> oh no, it's scary. Ah, my combo's not working. Ah, no, the throw. Ah, yes, let's go. <laughs> Tee -hee. We killed him. Like, legit. <laughs> I'm evil. And we took his points. <laughs> Yay. Okay, so let's see. Now we're, we were at 212. Now we're at 115 away. So we got 100 and some odd points. No, 90-something points. Math. I wish they would just put the numbers in the game. Then I don't have to do all this math work. But numbers. <laughs> numbers are a thing. Oh, God, I'm on a six-win streak. I really need to get rid of it. The win streak is not helping the situation. Definitely having easier opponents by having a lesser win streak that would be good we'll see <laughs> we'll see i didn't want to give up on the grandmaster <laughs> okay t800 lovely k no balls again i'm dave thank you j4 hey t craig thank you are you guys playing this game <laughs> are you getting the rewards I want that Mania skin. I'm going to get it. I will get it. Um, I Although I can't really sit down for like an hour to play the game. Unless it's breaking glitches and things like that. That's fun. Oh no, this guy is... He can take our points. Oh no, okay. Well, tables have turned. We must defend. Oh, it's Katana. <laughs> what was that? Well, this is nice low effort intensity <laughs> match. This is nice.
<laughs> oh no. <laughs> what are we doing? <laughs> I love matches. They're so stupid. <laughs> That's this was way better. Oh no, I'm so sorry. I didn't mean to kill you. But they're way better than um like uh a <laughs> hundred super meter segments. <laughs> Dude, I had to create a talisman to help me get a hundred meter segments. That was dumb. But this this is way dumber in a different way. <laughs> Aw, don't leave. We can have more fun. Oh no, she left. Our wind streak continues. Aw, bye. Mm. <laughs> okay, let's see where we're at. I think we're at 24, 2300, 20 something hundred. Jesus. I the the ui whoever designed this needs to be fired okay so we're at 2405 let us continue i'm playing tekken 8 oh very nice you know like tekken 8 i i do enjoy playing with friends but the fight pass mm 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 -mm, no way with the Tekken pass. No, no. Oh, is this one like this one? I don't know. This one might be tough. I wonder what kind of match this will be. Ooh. You know, I don't ever, I never really see Gearus, right? So this is all very just interesting to me. Ah, okay. Does he have overheads? <laughs> I don't or he just quit. Bye. <laughs> okay. Uh, you know, I ask these questions. It's pointless. <laughs> what What am I learning in this game? <laughs> I'm learning nothing. <laughs> this game is so... <laughs> I play it. Do you s I show you examples. <laughs> Look how silly it is. What do you mean they just quit? <laughs> okay, so we had two quits. We had, like, one legit match. And I brutalitied him. And then we've had two quits. Cool. <laughs> cool. No one wants to play with me. <laughs> Why? They're homophobic. They're phobic. <laughs> There's some sort of phobic. All right. Um, right. Let's play. Uh, ooh, it's Quan Chi. I've never played Quan, Quan Chi. I think he does have overheads. That teleport. Oh, it's rain. Oh. Uh -huh. I'm a bitch. 
I'm a bitch, I'm a lover, I'm a child, I'm a mother, I'm a sinner, I'm a saint. I do not feel ashamed. <laughs> what is this rain doing? <laughs> what is he doing? Hey, he blocked it. <laughs> what does that ball do? Oh, poor, poor baby. <laughs> that was unexpected. It never does the brutality for me. I hate that move. Oh my god, I didn't mean to fatality. I just pressed buttons. I was gonna do a sweep. Oh my god, I killed. Oh my god, I'm, I'm a bitch. I didn't, I mean, that just happened by accident. Please believe me. I am not that toxic. Oh my god, poor guy. Oh, I'm terrible. I didn't, I, I didn't even know that was fatality. I didn't, I didn't, I genuinely didn't even know. What did I do? I'm a bitch. Ooh, he got the water ball. Oh, look at this. Oh, no. Oh, no, he got me. Ah. Oh, was he fooling me with the first round? <laughs> Intense. <laughs> what? <laughs> That's intense. <laughs> Just the war. Ugh, we're not punishing with a combo. We should. I don't know his moves well enough to punish. <laughs> I'm not doing well. Okay, well, we got something there. <laughs> ah. Oh no, he got me. <laughs> he got me. <laughs> LOL, is that a low? <laughs> I'm learning. <laughs> That's good. Oh no, Rain. He got me. Oh, I'm dead. <laughs> I tried shielding, it did not work. <laughs> oh. 
Okay, uh, well, you know, if it works, it works. <gasps> and there, uh, uh. <laughs> damn it well we we had to work for that one it was amusing seeing the rain fatal blow it, that seems to be like a basic combo that maybe I could even do if I were to play rain <laughs> So I'm learning. Oh, wow. <laughs> I'm learning by accident? Because I didn't purposefully seek out this knowledge. The only thing I'm purposefully seeking out is a rank up. And we're five points away. Kind of makes me regret giving up 34 points with the turbo controller. Damn. Okay. And onwards we go. Uh, this one says hello. Hello, Morpheus. Oh, oh. Duwan, <laughs> have you changed your name? Hello, j -Ro. I also miss Reptile. I learned a new life hack. <laughs> LOL, CJ. Does it have to do with number two? <laughs> Most of your life hacks have to do with number two. Um, Yeah, hopefully your combat league journeys are going good. I just want it to be over. <laughs> let, it, let it be over. <laughs> Please. <sighs> okay. Oh, wow. So this is a Raiden. Seems like... Uh-oh. He's a Grandmaster. He's played a lot of matches. 93? 121? That's a lot. Mm. <laughs> okay, Dave. Is that a low? <laughs> he got me. I shouldn't have gone for the down three. <laughs> I'm dead. No, Dave. I'm trying to shield. It's not shielding. Shield me. Uh, save me. Uh, <laughs> I still got punished. I don't. I didn't even know that I pressed a button. Damn it. Ah, damn it. Oh no, Dave. Ah, Dave, we're, we're getting whooped. <laughs> No, Dave! Ah, damn it! He got me! I tried to jump him! Oh, no, fatality. Oh, no. I'm dead! Oh, no, Luke King! Oh, damn you, Raiden. What should I do? Should I give up? <laughs> that is the question. Should I give up? 
Uh, I guess try. I guess try. <laughs> Why not? Damn this Raiden! Okay, so what do I have to remember? He likes to amplify the electric fly. <clears throat> Damn. Damn it. <sighs> Damn it! <laughs> he got his throw off before me. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> Damn this guy. <laughs> I'm entertaining him for too long. <laughs> Let's fatality. <laughs> Let's give him a candy cane up the butt. <sighs> okay, one more match, Dave. One more match. Uh, keep it up. Damn. <laughs> Lol, Duan. Combat League is always fun. Doesn't I like MK11 was lots of fun with Combat League. <laughs> I enjoyed it. I love beating up people. That I guess that's why fighting games appeal. Ah. <laughs> what? <laughs> What's happening? Oh no, he's Serena. Uh-oh. I saw Kano running, and I'm like, what the hell is he running for? Don't choke, don't choke, Dave, don't choke, don't choke. Ah, 
damn it. <laughs> I don't know how to punish him. <laughs> if so, I could do combo. Ah, damn him. Dave. Damn it. <laughs> Fatal blow. <laughs> okay. We need to get some sort of combo on this guy. What can I punish? Is that forward kicky punishable? I should probably try and punish a teleport fly. <gasps> we got him! <laughs> Do you hear the electric crackling sound effect? That's a glitch. I'm gonna save that. That's a glitch. We got him! I can't believe we went on a nine win streak. <laughs> LOL. Let's go. We're done. Yay. F you combat league. <laughs> We're done. <sighs> I get to look at this Manyap costume now. Yay! Is he hoping for Demigod? That's a lot. I don't want to go Demigod in this game. There's no reward. Skin should be a Demigod. People who like MK1 never played MK11. Or didn't like MK11. MK11 was a vastly superior game. Uh, okay, so, well, we got this. Where's the, where's the man? <laughs> There's the man, yeah. <laughs> Yay, man, yeah, she's so fuck. Why is she so fuck? Oh my god, look, her her titties are red. She's got red bazoombas. Why? Oh my, what a weird thing to highlight. Oh yeah, we're like, this character, she looks like a man, but look at her bazoombas. I mean, it's no better than RuPaul's Drag Race, except RuPaul's Drag Race looks a lot better better a lot better um i uh, yeah i changed my name because i've been watching the matrix all day uh, very nice <laughs> yes watch the matrix <laughs> sounds cool i love the matrix i remember we had to watch it in school in the theater for um philosophy we had like a philosophy class so we, we got to watch it Maybe it wasn't the first one. Maybe it was the second one. I'm not sure. I don't remember. Um, CJ, whatever. Oh, wow, CJ. Gripping, thrilling, enticing. Thank you, CJ, for that wonderful piece of advice. Um, yay! I'm done. I'm so glad I'm done. I was, I was like, how, how much longer do I have to work on this? So yeah, no, honestly, this was less effort than a weekly quest. I think perhaps my hardest match was that Raiden. <laughs> um, this whole season, I played. Well, like you saw all the times that I played, I made streams about it. I couldn't handle it. Playing this game is such a... I just... I can't even bear to play it by myself. Thank you, my friends, for being here. All right, so this is Manya. It's like... It's like so terrible. It's like I just... I didn't know how terrible it was. Because all I could see of this costume previously was the front-facing PNG of the little... Like, when you look at it, you see in the bottom left how there's, like, a little image of it? Yeah, like, that's all I saw. Now I can see, like, everything, and it's not pleasing. I didn't know that the back of this costume was basically a headscarf so she's like she's muslim like malcolm x kind of muslim <laughs> she's that kind of muslim um she's also wearing this like ugly ugly head ornamentation is that supposed to be like a crown 
because it's not doing the job. It looks more like some of these designs look so superhero e rather than ninja. Like what? How does this? I I guess maybe this is saying priestess. Like, that's a nun habit? Like, I guess it's religious. This is some sort of religious um, garb, ornamentation. But then, like, what is this skull upon her breast? Do you see this? It has horns. On the booby? I can't get closer. We'll take a screenshot. <laughs> I want to see it. Like, what is this? Is that cute? God, they look like burn victims. <laughs> Why do they look like burn victims this season? So she's got exposed burn boob. Great. Like, the times that we're saying, hey, cover up, they're like, no, no, please take a look at it. No, no, you, you, you must look at it. Um, yikes. Yikes. So I do kind of like groan at people who say that this is season of havoc. Just why? This this is quite obviously some ugly inspiration meant for Melina. They've all got the goddamn Melina eyes. Knowing how long it takes them to do anything at NRS. You think you think they just slapped on those eyes? You think they just created a whole bunch of Molina-isms and invasions, named the skins? That was all just last minute? I just, uh, no. Occam's Razor. The simplest explanation is, is the most likely one. This is Season of Molina. Season of Chaos is a placeholder. If you would know that if you were on PlayStation and played with the backdating time console glitch. That was a great glitch. I miss that glitch. But, you know, when they say that this is supposed to be flesh pits, I do see that this is quite ugly like the flesh pits. I really don't like this kind of upholstery appearance with the inside part of the pants. Who's wearing all of these different textures together? It's like these people said, oh, I've got X, Y, Z, A, B, C, all of these effects. Let me just slam them onto the skin together, regardless of whether or not it makes sense. Regardless of whether or not, if it makes the character looks like she's got a couch coochie. Is, is this how we're referring to it? It looks like a couch. And it's on her coochie. So it's a couch coochie. Ugh. And then the, this, like, green thing. What are these, chaps? For when she takes out her big burrito and rams it in people? Like, what is... What is this? What is this? And of course, they've got to ha have high heels. That's how you know they're women. It's very easy to become a woman... Put on some lipstick and put on some high heels. And now you're a woman. Yep. <laughs> Mission solved. Mission accomplished. Wonderful. But all of the, you know, I, maybe this is coincidental. But like, do you guys know Rastas? Ja? <laughs> do you know about Ja? Do you know about King Selassie? Do you, do you know about Ethiopia? Do you know about all of these things? So, um, do you know about 420? <laughs> so the colors are like gold, red, and green. Isn't it giving kind of 420 vibe? Isn't it kind of giving? Wait, now we need to like look up Rasta picture. Rasta flag? Yeah, with the little lion. That's the Rasta flag. <laughs> do you get do you guys know the Rasta flag? So I'm gonna pull it up. Oh, it's so tiny. <laughs> I don't want it so tiny. I want it big. 
okay, we're just we're just trying to get it here. Mm. Mm. <laughs> As we're looking at Manya's booty. <laughs> oh god damn it. That's the that's the Rasta flag. Do you see it? It's like gold, red, green. <laughs> it kind of has the same colors here. Was that intentional or was that by accident? <laughs> I much prefer the Rasta flag. Because I don't want to be looking at Tanya's butt blanket. <laughs> what is what is this thing hanging off her ass? A towel? A butt towel? She's got a butt towel. It's not a cape. It's not... A tail. Well, like, what is what is what is the shit that us? Uh, they love to put ribbons and tassels on all sorts of things. And look, she even comes equipped with her own cock ring. <laughs> Do you see it? Look, there's the cock ring. <laughs> she comes with her own cock ring. Hey, look, she has car seat um beads. I was right to think this was some sort of upholstery. She's got the car seat bead. Necklace, bracelet, hip. What the? What? What? What would you call this jewelry? Some sort of necklace being repurposed as coochie accessory. I just, I hate it. I just. The more I look at it, like I wonder what Nina Garcia would say. She would. She would hate this shit. She would say never. She would never allow this to be in her magazine. This is this is this is garbage. Garbage. Okay, so um I guess like you know, there's like a a, bu a billion different patterns on this creature, right? Like you've got the armor, right? You've got like the pattern on the headscarf, the religious headscarf cuz she's a priestess. A Numgadi priestess. Please don't forget um, she's also got the, you know, culturally appropriated Rastafarian flag as a butt doily. She's got that couch coochie. Comes with her own cock ring. I guess the, at least the shoes and the armor match. Yeah. But, yeah, like, this is not so apparent with this skin, but... Her boobs are sort of just weirdly highlighted. Like, who would wear armor with two big circles cut out from it to shove your prestices through? That seems mightily painful. You know, I always remarked at this with Jade in MK11, because she would just shove her boobs through anything. Like, what, what the hell is this design? Oh, it's it's <laughs> blah, blah blah it makes me want to barf. And the other thing too about this, I don't know if this is particular with this skin or whatever, but there's like this hint of season one, like the red and yellow, just scarfed around the neck. It's it's so ugh. Okay, so then we come here. Yes, come here. <laughs> come here and take a look at this. Because if you want your mania a little bit more racy, perhaps you enjoy her in red. Oh, yes. Red and gallbladder green. <laughs> Just looking like some sort of bloody stool sample with a gallbladder in impaction. Yeah, isn't it beautiful? I'm losing the Rasta vibes here with this one because the colors aren't quite so right. So I'm guessing the Rasta was accidental. But it still has that religious motif, like looking like a nun. But she wearing armor that she got to stick her boobies through. Like, look at that. Could you imagine running in that with, like, a point separating your bo bosom? This some, seems like some sort of medieval torture. So, the metalwork here is, like, gold. 
bra bronze, not gold. You could say rose gold if you want. But it's... uh. Ugh. The shoes are in that nasty green color. That nasty acid green. It's... It's, it's what you expect for Mania. A place for your breasts and a place for your dick. <laughs> Wonderful. Okay. Um, let's see what you, you guys are, are saying. I hate this skin. That's why I played Combat League. <laughs> for this moment. <laughs> for this moment of looking at this masterpiece. This masterpiece in modern art. God, I hate modern art. <laughs> it's terrible. It's absolutely terrible. Okay. Hey, Dave, can you pick Sub-Zero and Scorpion when you get the chance? I miss those two. I'm sorry. I don't know how to play as them. Uh-oh. I only know how to play as Liu Kang. And I don't even know how to play as Kano. I know how to tap a button with Kano. That's all I know with Kano. <laughs> LOL. Um, I learned a new... Um, oh, yeah. I think you got... I got that. Oh, my God. <laughs> Thank you, CJ. Uh, I changed... Oh, yeah. We got that. Looks like a Wakanda character. Yeah, this could be like a priestess from Wakanda. Alejandro. <laughs> Alex. Hey, there. <laughs> yeah, this could totally be like a priestess from Wakanda. But she would be like a sex priestess, right? Because there's, like, cutouts for your breastuses and a cock ring. <laughs> like, she comes equipped with her own cock ring. Very nice. Um, Why do people say Tanya looks like she's out of Wakanda? I don't know. You tell me. <laughs> you tell me. Fear effect. Is she part crouch? She part couch. Yes. Because she does DC stealing from Marvel characters. I see it as, like, I haven't even seen Black Panther. I don't know what a Black Panther is. But there is a very obvious Africanization of Tanya compared to her previous iterations. That That's definitely, yeah, a thing. And you could call it, you know, Wakandaization. But I think the appropriate term that they use at the Political Congress for Gamescom is Africanization. They, they're actively trying to ac Africanize things in video games. That is a thing. At that Gamescom conference where we got a trailer for Mortal Kombat, I was, I was like, is no one seeing what this Gamescom conference is talking about? And like, no, no one cared. <laughs> but I saw it. And I was like, oh, damn, well, they're trying to Africanize things and make things non-binary. I mean, wonderful, but don't force it. Just make a new character if you want to have, like, this super, super Africa version by the way, I was watching a documentary, and the documentary said that all of us are African because <laughs> we were. <laughs> if you go back far enough, humans, Homo sapiens, came from Africa. So everyone now is African. There can be no more racism. If we're all African, we just gotta all look like men, yeah. <laughs> Why is she so fug? Okay, so this is Mania costume. Let's take a look at the other costume, cause why? <laughs> what, what what did I get? Oh, it was for Melina. Uh, you know, I think I might have seen these. <laughs> yeah, they do look terrible. Yeah, what is? There is like a fashion trend alert. Do you see it? It's it's couch coochie. <laughs> it's the couch coochie. Why? Why do they all look like they have upholstery by their snatch? I have a velvet couch that looks like that. That's a, that's a velvet couch coochie. And like the metal studding, it just looks it just looks uncomfortable. I mean, here the metal studding is at least on the bottom of the crotch flaps butt flaps well how do you what do you call this i guess a tail this is a tail this is more so tail 
than Manya's whatever she had. It's also confusing. Like, where is the fabric? Like, she's wearing fabric here in the back. But the texture of this outfit doesn't look like fabric. Maybe the bottom part. But this, like, green... What is that? Uh, what Crepe? It's some sort of, like, tortured crepe? Is that what it is? It looks really terrible. What are these textures? Why did someone think that this was a good idea? Whoever thought of this should be fired. Can can we all agree to this? This is such a terrible outfit. And of course, the reason why we get these is so we go look at the premium shop and go buy ourselves some micro penises. <sighs> okay, very unfortunate. So let's take a look at the Combat League rewards. What, what exactly did we get? Did you guys do Combat League? <laughs> do you even care? Um, yeah, I don't know about Combat League. Hey there, Drew. I officially have a stalker, guys. Death... What? What? Oh, Drew. What's going on? <laughs> that sounds so dramatic. Um, they gave Manya's A cup some love. Yeah, sure. Um, not a cooch ring. It's, yeah, God, it is. Why does she have that O ring there with all them straps? I know what that's for. Guys, we all know what that's for. Don't we? Jesus. So, yeah, I saw that on Boys in the Hood. <laughs> LOL. <laughs> Looks like a Final Fantasy villain, a terrifying one. You know what? I liked Caius from Final Fantasy thirteen. He had feathers in his hair, and he was pretty. <laughs> I liked him. Um. W yeah, wow. Yeah, I hope, I hope everything's okay, Drew. Okay, so let's take a look at this. So we got, oh my god, so did they actually add, they added a UI quality of life feature. This was not here previously. Where it says scorpion gear, katana gear, limei gear, that was not there before. Before I was just guessing what the hell I'm getting. <laughs> but now they're actually labeling it, which is, you know, it's, it's a step in the right direction, but it's not as good as MK11. MK11, we would get the names of all this stuff. Like, it would say it. Point seven seven four lawnmower, rifle, blah, 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 Aaron Black. Like, it would always be listed. So, I mean, like, they're trying to make improvements. I'm seeing it, but it's not enough. That's dumb. <laughs> they should do more. This little change to the UI, not enough. They should change the whole damn game. <laughs> the whole game needs to be, like, reworked. I guess stop working on this one and make a new game? Maybe that's the option? I think that's probably what's going to happen. That's what they did with MK11. They just stopped working on it, and they're like, oh, okay, new game. <laughs> but they couldn't do their stupid injustice that they wanted to. Oh, God damn it! If Injustice is the next game, I, I NRS is lost to me. I really hope David Saslov has smack sense into Ed Boon, NRS. Smack them silly. They need it. This game is so broken. <laughs> they need it. So, yeah, I really hope David Saslov just straightens them out. Takes away DC from them forces rock steady in their stupid <laughs> what is it sweet baby ink well they worked with rock steady for sure so let them work on dc that's the direction that they want for dc nrs is already woke but they just need talent can they just can, they can be woke just have talent just have talent damn it <laughs> okay so elder god skin for havoc we're not getting that do i care no 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 not at all no no <laughs> i don't know why people think that going to elder god is a value like did you ever go to elder god in mk11 
Oh, okay, so going to Elder God is easier in MK1. Got it. MK1 is just an easy game. I mean, it is. It took me less time to do Combat League to get to, get to Grandmaster compared with all of the weekly quests from this damn season. So that's that's kind of wild. And the Havoc skin, I guess like no one should feel any sort of way about not getting it because we already got Havoc skins. And you know what? All of these gear pieces, like, I just don't care about. Lee May, Katana, Scorpion, Gearus, Raiden. None of them are glowy. None of them are beautiful. What's the point of giving us all of this ugly gear pieces? It's just filler content. This is a filler season. Definitely a filler season of rewards. The pictures, too, for the combat cards. <laughs> wow, look, it's the flesh pits. Wow, look, it's Molina. Where's Havoc? Where's Chaos? Where, Where is it? For all those people who love conspiracies, like, where is it? Ugh. Okay, so let's take a look at, I guess, you know, let's check out some of the gear pieces. I mean, I did acquire them. <laughs> So, uh, we got Scorpion gear piece. I must have already looked at it. <laughs> Damn it. It was something plain, something boring. Great. And, you know, all of these things, we've all got, like, tons of reskins of them. Specifically Scorpion. Some of these gear pieces, he's got five of. Like, just so many damn reskins. Okay. Let's take a look at Katana. Oh, I guess I was looking at gear pieces for some reason. This is a combat league gear piece. Ugly, right? <laughs> right? <laughs> it's ugly, right? What is this? Why is it brown? Who thought brown was a great option for gear piece? You know, let's, you know, try and make it look different. We'll try granny claws it it's red i mean it's just basic what a basic fan especially this one i've got like already with metal tips why would i want these dull ugly tips <laughs> i'm going back to the lgbt fan <laughs> I love that they put in the LGBT fan. <laughs> Look, it's the LGBT fan. <laughs> why did they why did they put it in? Did we have LGBT fan in MK11? I don't think so. This is a new addition. <laughs> totally new. Okay, so we also got Lee May. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> Just perplexing. I why was I looking at these gear pieces? Or did we already have them? I think that's the one. Acquittal. Would be nice if they actually gave the name of the gear piece as opposed to just the picture. But yeah, that's it. That's the Combat League gear piece. Now I can make Kung Lao have purple arms. Yay. Great. Great. Okay, let's take a look at Raiden. So this is his hat. Oh, it's, like, pink. <laughs> well, I mean, like, I was... What What was I wearing before? Oh, my God. Don't tell me I have a new option. <laughs> it's, like, pinky. I can't hate it. Oh, I wish I could. <laughs> but it's pinky. <laughs> Look, it's pinky. I can go on Elder God on MK11 and I never will. It's just too much damned boring playing that much. Exactly. I played Combat League for definitely less than two hours of match time. But if you include like matchmaking and just chatting, then it's going to be, you know, yeah, like two hours, 20 15 i don't know northern just tell her she's pretty it's what she wanted to hear all her life oh no is manya stalking you yes 
she is. She's stalking me in my dreams. Um, Manya is dressed like Poison Ivy. That's a good comparison. I see that. Um, damn. Okay, well, at least we have a pink option. I wish, um, I wish his pants were pink. <laughs> I wish he was just pink. I wish there was a season of pink. Would have been good if it was Melina's season, but you got what you got, right? All right, so let's see. Um, what else did we get? There's a gear piece for Reiko, and there's a gear piece for someone else. <laughs> what? No, not my stats. Oh, I went on a 10-win streak. Look, it's a 10-win streak. <laughs> That's the benefit of having all of those losses. It's really easy to get a win streak. Um, So, rank rewards. So, we got Reiko, Gearus. Okay, Reiko and Gearus. Reiko, Gearus. Okay, gotta remember. So, in MK11... When we were doing this, it would it would also be like got to remember which character and which gear slot, because Gears has like some of them were kind of similar. Sand battery, temporal anchor. What the hell is the difference? They're just things that he sticks on to himself. So yeah, maybe they didn't try hard enough with Gears, <laughs> but yeah, I can see that they uh, definitely didn't care here. I guess that was one of the reasons, maybe, too, why it was, like, easy to adapt Gears to this game is because, like, his his gear pieces were... Like, the one on the front, I've always found it underwhelming. And somehow they chose that to be the one that can change with your customization. Like, I think the sand battery on the back is more interesting than the one glued to his boobs. And I guess his most interesting gear piece was the huge fist. Because who wouldn't want to be fisted by Gears? But now, it's he's scrawny. They're all scrawny. <laughs> Why? And no customization. So let's take a look. This is the Combat League one, Time Quake. Ooh, time quake. So, uh, I mean, there's lots of gear pieces. There's another one of the same shape and design. Doesn't really look that different with this uh, skin. There's more pink options that I could use. So, like, it's like, why do they give us these filler content? I can't find Combat League rewarding or worthwhile if the rewards are always so shit. And I don't know how other people can find it, you know, rewarding. Maybe it's fun. It is fun. I do like getting 10 win streak. That is good. Yeah, let me be beat up people. But that's also because I'm exploiting the game. Like, other people don't know how to exploit the game, apparently. Which is unfortunate. But yeah, this 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 combat league experience shouldn't be so exploitable. But oh well, I have the rewards. So let's go to what is it, Reiko? So he's blind like Kenshi. This one he has at least eye slits. This is like cloth covering his eyes what's going on i don't know about this reiko oh you know i've never seen his different gear pieces he can be bald great it seems like all of the characters can be bald including lee men <laughs> that one's very pink oh that one's pink and glowy <laughs> Uh, you know, it's really hard to get pink skins for all these characters. There's none for Smoke. None for Sub-Zero. Barely one for... Uh, Scorpion? Yeah, oh well. 
Interesting. It's pink. So these gear pieces, they're not really exciting. I think the, the most exciting one I got was this. For Raiden, because now he has, like, a pink hat. But that's it. <laughs> that's it. The skins, they're, ugh. Like, wow. <laughs> Something I'm never going to use. Let's take off that Mania skin. I'm going to use the Mania skin that I paid for. <laughs> this was my first purchase in the game. Had to get Funkera Mania so that she could be funky with her big stick. Yeah. Nice. <laughs> this game. It's so terrible. Okay, let's see what you guys are saying. Thank you for joining. Um, I always go up to Demigod and stop right there. Even in MK1, I just, I can't. I, I... I wouldn't want to do all of that effort for a gear piece. Maybe if it was a skin. Maybe if it was a skin. But, yeah, it that's wild. I did not realize that. Do you see that? The Demigod reward and the Apprentice rank reward, both for Scorpion. You know, I didn't really play Scorpion this season. Played more smoke in Sub Zero than I don't think I faced one Scorpion. I mean, then again, I didn't really do lots of matches. Let's check this out. Okay, so we're at twenty five sixty three. I played twenty four matches. I won. Like if 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 we have to think about how many matches I played. I won 24. Six of those were with Turbo Controller. Like, people would quit or someone couldn't beat the Turbo Controller. So, I did get wins via that. So, 24 less 6. We're at 18. Yes. <laughs> so, I played like 18. Ma I played 18 matches this season. Okay. I did not lose. Oh, I, I guess, well, uh, let's count that one Sub-Zero match that I quit out of n mid. <laughs> I quit mid. <laughs> yeah, I did put it in some effort. We'll count that as a loss. So we'll do 19 matches. So I played 19 matches this season. You saw them. They were all in the stream. I played 19 matches. I got to Grandmaster. That's... I think maybe my best record yet. That's kind of wild. I think it's the turbo controller really assisting out. Having all of those losses without me having to do anything? Great. And even with a 10-win streak, we're still at 3.6 million. The power of the turbo controller just giving you all of those L's. It's really good. <laughs> really, really good. Also, I guess, like, when you get above champion, like, I will forfeit at the beginning of the match. And I don't count those as me actually playing the game. That's just me giving points away. But I think that's worthwhile because you, you really do need to take L somewhere. Getting a win streak is good if you're near your goal. But when you're not near, it, near your goal, having a win streak is... I would say detrimental to the exploitative process. So, Manya, here we are, <laughs> staring me in the face with your red bos <laughs> bosom. <laughs> Very beautiful. Um, We had, like, a big butch daddy Kano in MK11. Yes, we did. And he was always whipping out his dick and peeing everywhere. Um, although, if you had, like, free camera, he, he didn't actually pull out his dick. They didn't animate it. <laughs> they didn't animate it. The fact the rank resets each season surely makes it feel pointless. Well, they've been doing that from MK11. And it does feel a little bit more pointless here. Because A, seasons are so long. B, there's less rewards. 
see there's there's no reason there's no fun like i mean the fun comes from beating people but i don't think the fun comes from the actual game that's the problem the gameplay feels like tedious and they do make it very tedious because we have to do it over and over. I mean, if it was just fun, I don't think we would have a problem with the resetting rank. I don't know. <laughs> it would be nice if you went to, like, in MK11. I used to go demigod all the time. So it would be nice if you started off the season already at, I don't know, warrior or champion, and then I wouldn't have to, you know, give away a bunch of losses, and then I could continue onwards, but, um, I would always be giving away losses, yeah, you know, those early ranks are really good for turbo boosting, <laughs> I'm gonna stick with that, turbo boosting all the way to warrior, I guess is preferable, because then I, you can take advantage of the global lead, you know, I'm just thinking too much, um, I was going for champion, but didn't get there. I didn't play much, though. <laughs> it's not worth it. Don't worry. Um, love you, Kara. Uh, yeah, I went to about 1296. I got to 1296 with just turbo controller. So I was like 200 points or so away from champion. And I was like, okay, well, let me push my luck. So I continued with the turbo controller <laughs> and I was losing points. I lost 34 points and I'm like, okay, well, I guess I have to play now. <laughs> Damn. But yeah, I, I guess like in the future season, turbo, 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 everything. Turbo is really useful. And I think it's amusing too if you do get wins with the turbo. <laughs> Uh, it is for me. <laughs> Very experienced fighting. Um, insane. So yeah, wow. Manya, here today, gone tomorrow. If you want Manya, hopefully you're already completed Combat League because Combat League is ending. Season is ending. Have you completed everything that you wanted to? Have I? I think so. I mean, I would like to do some more <laughs> glitching <laughs> secret activities but that's like um something i can probably do like <laughs> falling asleep <laughs> uh yeah i think that's the best way to play this game as some sort of melatonin replacement it is sleep inducing isn't it wow um but yeah if you really enjoyed this please join the fam much love to my brothers and sisters in the fam. Love you, Kara. <laughs> Yay. Kara's here. Um, Morpheus. Yeah. Name change. <laughs> Did you also get a sex change too? <laughs> Morpheus. Um, just drew. Love you. Just drew. Thank you. Um, J4. YFX uh, for being here. And all of you too. Thank you for making it to the very end. Leave a like. Leave a dislike or get the hell out. Stream is effing over. <laughs> Yay. Um, until next time, take care. Peace. Love you guys.